Good morning, Pirates, and welcome to PCTV News. I'm Nathan Straubel. And I'm Lauren Leocardi. So, Lauren, we got an assembly today. What's it about? Um, it's for the veterans of our country. That's cool. They have such a hard job, and it's really challenging. So, speaking of challenging, Stuco challenges the mentors to a duel at the trivia night at 7 o'clock on November 21st at the high school. Mentors, it is your turn to challenge somebody else. Little Shop of Horrors will run this Thursday through Saturday in the Wilson Auditorium. Tickets can be purchased in advance for $7 from platchs.seatyourself.biz or at the door. Tara has more information on what's happening this week. Let's send it over to her to get the scoop. Thanks, Nathan. Nathan forgot to mention some important events that transpired over the weekend. You just received your news from the runner, Nathan Straubel, who took fifth place at state. Rebecca Geddes, a freshman, also ran at state and took 16th place. Both runners are all state. Congratulations. If you couldn't tell from the weather this morning, winter sports have begun. Winter track and field workouts are now after school at 3. Boys and girls basketball have also begun their practices every day after school. If you are not in a winter sport and are interested in playing baseball, there will be a meeting after school today in Room 52. There will be a boys swim banquet at 6 this Thursday as well. There aren't many pirate games to watch as winter sports are still in practicing stages, but many of you probably watched your Kansas City Chiefs after they came back from a 17-13 win against the Buffalo Bills. You all should be happy that you're not Bears fans. If you aren't a fan of football but watch golf, Bubba Watson took first in the World Golf Championships. Way to represent America! Today, fall sports tur turn to winter as it gets windy and colder at 34 degrees. Then tonight, it's going to continue to get even colder at 14 degrees. Notice a little real feel of negative one. It's definitely sock weather if you have hardwood floor or tiles. And tomorrow, the sun comes out, but you won't feel it at 28 degrees. That's all I have for sports and weather. Back to you, Lauren. Thanks, Tara. Today after school, there will be an art club meeting in room 46. Also today after school is an after academic bowl meeting in room 56. There will be at 1030 on Friday there will be a fire drill here at school. It's time for Celebrity 101 where the biggest news unfolds right before you. Man is there a lot of news today so let's get started. Nicki Minaj's new lyric video for her new song Only which features Drake, Lil Wayne and Chris Brown is taking a ton of heat for its Nazi-inspired theme. Another video released was the, for Taylor Swift's song, Blank Space. The video addresses the media and their constant need to be a negative connotation to a love, love life. Ye yesterday also marked the premiere of Mockingjay in London. The Hunger Games movie premieres next Friday, November 21st, with early showings on Thursday night. Apparently, China celebrates today, November 11th, as Singles Day because it has four single ones in 1111. So a man wanted to propose a day early to his girlfriend so they wouldn't be alone on the holiday. He proposed with a 99 iPhone 6S in the shape of a heart and stood inside and despite the arrangement, the girl said no. What? What will he do with all those phones? He spent over $82,000 on them. You could buy them and propose to me. That sounds desperate, Lauren. Oh, I'd say no and keep the phones. On a more positive note, you can now edit your Instagram captions. That really is nice. Since PCTV News only has a Twitter, go and follow your favorite anchors on Insta. I'm at the better Nathan, and Lauren is Lolo Leonardo. That's all we have for today. We'll be watching to see if you follow us. Once again, Lauren is desperate. Keep it fresh, pirates.